Rebels infiltrated Russia to overthrow Putin. A part of the fighters of the Russian Volunteer Corps and the Free Russia Legion remained on the territory of the Federation to continue the fight against the regime of Russian President Vladimir Putin. This was said by Andriy Yusov, representative of the General Intelligence Department of the Ministry of Defense of Ukraine. We can definitely say that the resistance against Russia is getting stronger. If we talk about the recent events in Belgorod region, yes, a certain part of the Russian Volunteer Corps and the Free Russia Legion remain on the territory of Russia to continue the struggle and attract new supporters, said Yusov. He noted that in connection with this, the geography of struggle of the Russian Volunteer Corps and the Free Russia Legion is expanding and the scope of activities is increasing. According to him, the recent events in the Belgorod region have become the most massive armed resistance against the Putin regime in the center of Russia in recent times. On May the 21st, the Russian volunteers of the Corps and the Legion announced that they had started an operation in the Belgorod region. According to them, two soldiers were wounded as a result of the operation. In addition, they seized armored personnel carriers, small arms and other equipment. Ukrainian military intelligence said it was a special operation by the Russians themselves. It is said that the fighters of the Russian Volunteer Corps are currently in the village of Glotov. It has been the potential to be embarrassing for President Vladimir Putin, who has, for 15 months, been leading an invasion he baselessly claimed was needed to keep Russia safe. With limited returns on the battlefield, Putin may now face discontent that the war is disrupting life at home.